What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebase.com. 2023 Fanatics Under Wraps signed football jerseys just sold out. This is a three boxer, uh, five random players each, number five. And again, guys, 18 total spots. Everybody gets a five random players for the list below. Remember, Moon and Aikman are combo. Chasing some big names like Brady, Peyton, Jefferson, Tua, and much more. So we're going to times the names by five. So that's one, two, three, four, and five. So there you go. That should be five times. Makes the list a total of 90. Roll it. Three and a five, eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Three and a five, eight, eight. Ryan, down to Steve. Eight times, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight times, eight times. Jerome Bettis, down to Brian Erlacher. All right, well, <clears throat> I'm not gonna announce every single name because there's like 90 names, but I'll let you see it the way it is like this. And then I'm gonna alphabetize it by customer name and show you really quickly what players you got. So Allen, you got Marcus Allen down to Darren Waller. And in that little list of names, you got Dan Marino, ED, Damian Pierce, Swift, Garrett Wilson, etc. And Brandon, of course, your fiver from Patrick Mahomes down to Je Eddie George. David, you have from Tua Tagovailoa down to ben, Big Ben Roethlisberger. In there, you got like A.J. Brown, Sauce, Bo, Jackson, Ed Reed, etc. Deion Sanders, too. Eugene, you have Chris Carson down to Charles Woodson. And there you got a little T-Log, Justin Jefferson, Jamar Chase, a couple old school Cowboys, legendary Hall of Famers. Mason, Jordan Love down to John Riggins. You have a couple running backs in there with Eckler, Clyde edwards -Alaire, Larry For Leonard Fournette. Michael L, Jalen Waddle, down to Lane Vanderesh, with Tom Brady, Zach Wilson, and Chase Young. Ryan G, Bettis, down to Matt Ryan. And Steve, I think you have a, the, the good amount of them. You have pretty much most of them. You got from Roger Staubach down to CD, and in between there you got like Cup, you got the combo, Rogers, you know, Pay Manning, Barry Sanders, Elway. All those there, and then I'll show you the rest of them right now in a few seconds. And then you have the rest of them down there. So you got like Ray Lewis, Bradshaw, Tarkenton, Falk, Taylor, Erlacher. So you have quite a few. <clears throat> and then TJ, you're the last one. You got Parsons, Michael Parsons down to Michael Vick, Last Spot Mojo as well. Randy Moss in there, John Montana, Jerry Rice. Couple big Hall of Famers there. All right, Ivan wants to play. Got the Tigers and Marlins. And got the White Sox. Well, there you go. Five left. There's still a $49 Brewers team, guys. Oh, yeah, we can play. There's, there's enough people watching. You guys want to do that? That's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got time. I got time. I comes down to five, guys. Somebody maybe wants to knock off, like, the Brewers and Pirates. We can just R&B up the Royals, Rays, and Blue Jays or something. Or just the Royals, Rays. I don't know. <clears throat> 
All right, well, I don't think there's going to be any trades, so I'll leave it as is for now, and I'll, I'll advertise it by player. And uh, let's start. Oh, there's 23 people in here? Nice. Okay, that's just people I want to watch. All right, then, here we go. So, again, these boxes were labeled saying number five, and then there was a note on here saying for three box YouTube, so I kind of have to go with these jerseys since that's what it was labeled for. So I'm going to start with the top, top box. You guys can see it on the top camera. I'm going to try to take a small peek so I can get the little uh, index card and then play a little home eye. <clears throat> oh, wow. That Notre Dame guy's gone. He's gone. Wow, what a kickoff return. Where the hell is this index card? Well, I think I know who it is. I can't find the index card though, but so I'm gonna eyeball it, but I think I know who it is. <laughs> Hopefully it's this guy. Alright, I am a former all-pro running back in the NFL who played for 16 seasons. Played primarily with this team uh, for most of his career for 11 out of the 16. And was considered one of the greatest goal line and short yard runners in NFL history. Was born in Cali, went to college here in Southern California, was a first round pick in 1982. Super Bowl champion, Super Bowl MVP, most valuable player in the NFL in 1985. And uh, six time Pro Bowler, two time rushing champion, touchdowns leader, <laughs> NFL rushing leader in 85. National champion in 1978. Uh, unanimous All-American. Retired number 33. There you go, Grizzlebees got it. Was a former running back out of USC, guys. Played for the Raiders primarily in his, in his career. And yes, Grizzlebees got it. So, nice Raiders. Marcus Allen jersey. And it is a nice Mitchell and Ness. Tag says 150. Nicely stitched. And it does have a Hall of Fame inscription as well, actually. See right there. Hall of Fame, I think, 03, I think it says. There you go, Marcus Allen. And actually, there's the index card. It's hiding all the way over here. Nice. So, yeah, we'll fold it up nice back nicely before we ship it off, so don't worry. Um, tick, tick, two. Where's the tick, tick? No tick? I guess no tick. All right, Marcus Allen. Is Alan Matsui. Oh, tape's over here. Hell yeah, man. Let's make it up and have an iPhone, buddy. Hell yeah. That's, that's the best way to kind of wash out a bad taste. Is just get back up there. Next at bat. Alright, so... Alan, Matsui, number five. All right, next box, guys. Next box, next box.
I want you guys to see. All right, next one. All right, so I'm a former wide receiver in the NFL. Uh, won a Heisman Trophy. And becoming the first receiver to win a Heisman Trophy in college football history. Spent 16 seasons with this team that he played for. Played one, te one year with the... Tampa Bay Buccaneers, but pretty much his whole career, <laughs> right? Went to Notre Dame, was drafted in the first round, pick six. I should give it away, and I think someone already got it. Ed put a question mark, but he's not sure. <laughs> he's not sure. Nine-time Pro Bowler, NFL receptions leader in 1997, uh, part of the 1990s All-Decades team. Like I said, Juana Heisman, Juana, Juana Walter Camp. Won a, uh, a uh, UPI Player of the Year. Hall of Famer in the NFL. Had over 14,000 receiving yards. And yes, if this was a random team break, the Raiders would be eating. And yes, it was Tim Brown. And actually, this jersey is way sicker than the other one. First of all, look how thick this jersey is. I don't know if you guys can see it through the, through the break. But first of all, nice inscription there, Hall of Fame 2015. There's the autograph. But this jersey's legit. This, this, first of all, this thing is heavy. This is probably like a real authentic jersey. Wow. This one has the Mitchell and S $300 price tag. This is legit. This is probably the jersey that they played with back in the day. Wow, it even has the 75 anniversary tag on it. Look at this. This is a jersey right here. Nice patch and everything too. Very, very nice Mitchell and Ness. Very, very nice jersey. This one is really nice. <laughs> Alright, yeah, so this is a $300 jersey retail. Now add the autograph, add the authentication. This is a legit jersey. And uh, who has Tim Brown? TJ Poyer, last spot mojo. Look at that. Very nice, buddy. <clears throat> now that is a nice jersey. the box here guys last ball mojo hits 60% of the time every time all right again I'm gonna kind of lift it up just a little bit so you guys don't peek All right, I'm a former NFL quarterback uh, that played for one team my entire career. Also attended Notre Dame in the 70s. I'm a Super Bowl champion. Was an NFL Most Valuable Player in 1983. Offensive Player of the Year in 83. Man of the Year in 82. All-Pro in 83. Two-time Pro Bowler. 
Yeah. Not in the NFL Pro Football Hall of Fame, but part of the College Football Hall of Fame. And yeah, I think when he had his Heisman campaign, they, they changed his name just a little bit, right? Wasn't his name pronounced Feesman? Ed already said it earlier. Ed got it right away. I think he might have seen the colors, a little peeker. <laughs> but uh, then changed his name to like Joe Theismann. <laughs> But yeah, it's going to be Joe Theismann, guys. Ed got it right away. <laughs> you freaking cheeky, huh? All right. Nice inscription, though. Look at that. Beautiful signature, first of all. Super Bowl champ right there, inscription. Really, really nice. And again, another really nice Mitchell and S jersey. Now, this one isn't the, the $300 price tag. This one's the 150 but... Still solid jersey. No, that is true. Once you see it, once you see the colors, you already know, right? So yeah, really, really nice one there, guys. Some solid jerseys. I mean, obviously, you know, a little bit more on the veteran side, but still really nice. <laughs> yeah, for real, right? That's all good. All right, well, now the grand question is who has Joe Theismann? <sighs> Joe, we did it, Joe. Wow. Not one of his last spot mojo spots, but he grabbed two spots. TJ Poyer again. Back-to-back -back hits. All right, well, I do see a couple more boxes or break or cases out there, guys. So I will post another one up, guys. That one should be from a fresh one. I don't know why the the boxes got mixed up or what. I mean, this should have been a fresh one, but I, I guess maybe they opened up a fresh one. Number four, number three might have been Lucy's. I don't know. Either way, thank you guys so much. That was fun. <laughs> like I said, I'll post another one up, and uh, we can get that going, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.